what is up gang it is august 5th 11 what does i say 11 25 afternoon well no it'd be pre-noon what do you what do you know it's just midday ish uh we just got done i just registered registered at our my de college for with all my stuff so i got my de stuff ready for my senior year um we're stopping by Chipotle because I need a pre-workout meal because I'm going to my high school to work with the weightlifting coach. Um, the weightlifting coach is also the same coach that we would lift weights for um, when I was practicing with the football team. But yeah, so I'm going there to, he's gonna help me with my clean and my snatch, help me get that going uh, before weightlifting season. But I needed a pre-workout meal, so we're gonna go to Chipotle. Um, I'm gonna get a bowl because I'm cutting and I don't need the extra carbs that are in a tortilla because rice is not an option. Rice is like never like a no option. We always get rice, no matter what. Bro, I'm not even that far over. Like you you can stay mad if you want, jeez. But yeah, so we're gonna go in. We're gonna get this anabolic AF meal and uh, then we're gonna go lift some heavy weight. Uh, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the video if you like it that much, and uh, yeah. What's up, guys? Who's got back in the car? Hold up, one second. Dad, come in. All right. We just got back in the car from Chipotle. I went in and I ate alone. I didn't eat with anybody. And I know some people say like it's like super weird. To like go out and eat in public but honestly i brought in my headphones which these bad boys i just brought those in and i just watched i watched c-bomb and a uh, von walker vlog no it was just a von walker vlog with brett i can't think of his name it's the one he dropped three days ago but anyways uh great meal rice the the my order for chipotle it depends if i get like a wrap or a bowl I got a bowl and I got white rice, chicken, queso, pico, lettuce. That is the absolute best shizak I've ever ate in my life. And then their watermelon limeade, oh my God. I fangirl about watermelon limeade the same way girls fangirl about Panera bread drinks. But feel like <laughs> a little bloated right now because I don't know why, but whenever I eat Chipotle, it's like always so dense for some reason. So it like makes me like super bloated. But hopefully that goes down by the time we get to the AP classroom. Coach Coach Paley's first name starts with an A. I'm not gonna say his first name if he ever watches this. But I call the weight room the AP classroom because that's like where he does all of his work and stuff like that. So gonna do that. I'm probably gonna get gas on the way and then we're gonna go lift some heavy circles. Yo, what is up guys? We just got done with Coach Bailey. It is raining hard right now. We got a, we got a thunderstorm in the air, yeah. And yeah, this school's really prone to being struck by lightning. We actually have our, our one of our assistant admin, um, he was an assistant principal at another high school in the area, like way, way before I ever moved here. and. Um, a student got struck by lightning in the courtyard at school so anytime there's like any storm of like any minor show of lightning or whatever he like always comes over the intercom like hey uh, staff and students there is dangerous lightning in the area and we're just like oh really there's lightning you're kidding but yeah so um it is i got here at like i almost got here at like 11 45 because now it's uh one so yeah, been here, hour 15, got one workout in. It's gonna be a heck of a great day. I had, I'm glad I had Chipotle because I needed the carbs because that kind of sucked. Because I'll, I'll try and get the snatch film to, um, shoot, I'll try and get the snatch film that Paley took of me because that's gonna be like some progress. I'm only moving 65 right now, but I'm also like just now learning. I'm sure once I get like the technique together and stuff like that, I'll be moving like a bunch more weight. But um, yeah, because like he said for like the snatch category last year for my weight class, it's like kids who are doing like 135 and qualifying for state. 
I'm not trying to do 135. I am trying to get to state, but, but, I if if I have to do 135 just to get to state, yeah, sure, I'll save my energy for big boy weight when I actually get to state. But yeah, so now I'm gonna go home, hang out for a little bit. Um, let me think. probably gonna stream probably gonna stream if you're watching this and you're not already following the stream it's G I N G G I E E E Gingy I couldn't make it simpler because simpler names are already taken that was lightning but uh, yeah there's a nice Kawasaki out here I didn't even realize it until just now it's a good looking bike but yeah so we're gonna go home gonna hang out hopefully mom's there if, if she is I'll be sure to introduce her on the vlog but yeah so that's one workout for today that's like my weightlifting workout and then now we're gonna go do the bodybuilding workout and go for 245 again tonight because i did it i tried to so what well, here's what happened i was going pr 245 you know of course but um i do warm-up so i was doing a warm-up of 225 which i've done i've hit 225 so many times but I start to do that 225 on that bench and that bench or something, I don't know what happened, but I, I didn't like drop it. I didn't like suicide grip it, but like I got 225 down to my chest and like wasn't coming back up. So I was, I was in a really bad mood last night, but I got some wrist wraps for the wrist stability. So we're gonna do it again tonight. I think Reese is joining me since Reese isn't in football anymore. So, Hopefully Reese is there because I need a spot. Plus, it'll just always be good to see Reese. So, um, yeah, yeah, we're gonna go home, and I'll check in with y'all when I get home. Gang, we back home. You know how it is. Um, would you shut up, Jesus? My brother's next door, and he's making like all the noise in the world. Uh, right now we got the sauna suit on since we cutting. This makes me sweat a whole bunch. Kind of sucks, even though I sweated a whole bunch with Coach Bailey earlier. But, uh, yeah, so, anyways, fuzz ball, that's nasty. So, anyways, basketball pillow on the bed. We got, so, raw stuff might actually be here today. I'm not sure, though. Don't hold me to that. If it does, we got an unboxing. If not, oh, well. We got laundry to put up because my grandma did it when I was gone. I started to load right before because I came to the house right before um, I went to the college because I had originally been at the school this morning with my mom to, uh, helping um, organize this like uh, clothes closet for like school wear and stuff like that. So I was helping her with that. So I came home, started a load, then my grandma ended up doing that load and another load just because she could. And I'm just like, why? Why would you do that? I'm so grateful, but why? But yeah. Gotta love Granny. Granny's awesome. Granny's a blessing in this whole family's life. But yeah, so there's that. And then, man, I love it. I love it when my shoes look all nice and bright. Th these are iconic. I wore, the, I wore these all the time this past year. And then I picked up my shoe game even more because I used to be a huge sneakerhead. But um, when I had a growth spur, I had to give all my cool shoes to my brother, who is not a sneakerhead. So he just, like, doesn't wear half of them. But, yeah, so there's that. Um, we got the, as y'all already know, the, the, the swords. But then we also got the gorilla flag. Gorilla car care. Absolutely bomb company. I love that company. They make all the soaps and stuff I use on my cars and my parents' cars. Um, all their soaps smell like fruit. So there's that. But like their foamy shampoo. That smells like bananas. It's pretty lit. But uh, yeah. So just want to check in. I'm going to read 10 pages in my book because that's part of 75 Hard. I recently started a program, as I just said. It's called 75 Hard. 75 days. There's three phases. Um, cold shower, one outdoor workout, one, you can do one indoor workout, you can do two outdoor, but one is mandatory to be outdoor. 
um, 10 pages a day, 10 minutes of visualization, eight critical tasks, follow diet, no cheat meals and no alcohol. I feel like I'm missing something. I don't know. More than enough. We're on day three. It's going great. It's going good. I would highly recommend it to anybody who's looking to uh, build up their mental toughness. Definitely recommend it for that. Um, just trying to think, like, is there anything else? But... Reese. Reese is going to be at the gym. Reese is going to be at the gym tonight. I got to go get Lucas from football at 5. It is, it's like, it's almost like 2 o'clock. He's about to leave here in a little bit for practice. Um, so there's that. Soundbar investment it's a good investment and then oh wrist wraps uh they're down in the car y'all you'll, you'll see them at night um and then so is that uh, i have a yoga ball for a chair like while i'm streaming while i'm gaming stuff like that this this is the stream setup got like the little camera little camera i got a wired in controller so i didn't know that this was wired in when i bought it but i really like the color of it so my wireless one is down there but so keep the laptop right there for when we streaming we got gum we got leo we got the og sponsorship box from lowered empire that was for yada r.i.p yada that that was my first car i drove a 93 uh mazda miata and that, I, I loved that car so much um headphone stand over there we got the lamp the lamp the lamp is such, it's such an op. I love this lamp. It's so, oh my goodness. It's just perfect because it illuminates my desk and shines out enough light to where you can still see me in my room but not see everything in my room. Shout out to the Darth Maul Lego thingy. That's also photo wall. That's vision board. That's vision board. You got Mr. Olympia and first form athlete. That's number one. You got mod car 2022 20, summer. That did not happen very much because I sold my car and then I got it like halfway through the summer. So there's that. And then the third one is start saving for a family with Nat. I've really been focusing on um, the Olympia stuff and the, the um, dieting and stuff like that. And... I need to focus more. I need to get back on that. And then Nat's in, Nat's in Colorado. Again, sad. She'll be back Monday, though. We'll be vlogging Monday. You'll see Nat. Um, so, actually, after tonight, if I hit this 245 bench PR that I want to hit, um, I'll be in the 1,000-pound club. Because I can squat 335, and I, and I pulled 420 yesterday so if i can pull this 245 tonight or push bench whatever this 245 tonight i'm good i'm in the 1000 pound club i don't want to just be in the 1000 pound club though i don't want to be like oh you made it to the just 1000 pounds no that's stupid we're gonna go for like over a thousand pounds next time i squat max i hope it's like 345 because i've been training my legs <sighs> So hopefully that works out. Um, yeah. I'm going to read because I haven't done my 10 pages. I need to do that. And then I'll probably go for a walk with my weight vest. It's a 40-pound weight vest. Um, yeah. It's going to be a great day. I can feel it. But, so, I'll check in with y'all when I get to the gym tonight. Deuces. What up, gang? We just got done actually um, reading the 10th pages part of 75 Hard. Oh, Alex. Um, I'm actually not going to stream right now. I'm going to stream tonight whenever I get back home from the gym with Reese. Um, the book that I'm reading for 75 Hard, it's, it's not going to last 75 days since I'm reading 10 pages a day. But it's actually by the guy who like founded and like created the whole like 75 hard program he's actually the 
founder of First Form, the, the athlete search I'm in. Um, it's by Andy Frisella. It's called 75 Hard. It's um, a tactical guide to winning the war with yourself. It's uh, kind of got like this sim a similar, um, not attitude, but like in-game goal as to uh, winning the war in your mind by Greg Rochelle that I read earlier this year. And um, that the Greg Rochelle book, definitely go read that. That is a fantastic book. Another one of my favorite books to read is um, Lone Star by Mike Lupica. Um, it's just a good book. It's not like something like cr crazy. It's just, just overall great book. Um, right now we're gonna, um, if you're wondering like why I'm in a jacket, it's a, uh, it's sweat in time. So under the jacket, we have a sauna suit. And then we got shorts on, like heavy, heavy material shorts and sweatpants. So yeah, we, we sweating. Then about four o'clock, I'm gonna go for a run. But right now, we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna thaw out some chicken breast. That's what we're gonna do. So yeah, let's go to chicken. Mm. Mm. Do, do I wanna change hats? Nah, nah, I'm okay right now. I'm gonna make sure I'm not like missing something here. You know what, I got this for a reason. I don't know why I don't wanna just, you know, use it. One second again. It's so much better, Yas. Okay, no, let's go downstairs. Rain's in her room. Okay, old woolies. Mom's in the shower, dad's in the restroom, so we're just gonna go out here. We got this 10 pound bag, chicken breast. Like, this, we're in the laundry room right now. Now we in the garage. Why is the light on, bro? Light don't need to be on, man. Ain't nobody out here. And then we got, so we got the normal fridge. Then we got deep freezer. And it's just, you know, it's deep freeze stuff, duh. And we got, the, oh shoot. We just got this clamp on is because it doesn't like to stay fully shut. But um, ever since we put this like big old C clamp on it, it stays shut perfectly. So yeah. This is, this is for dinner. I'm actually gonna meal prep. I'm not gonna meal prep all 10 pounds of it, but I'm definitely gonna meal prep a good old chunk of it. So yeah, all right, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Okay, so make sure I set y'all up. Good, good POV, hold on. Is that, okay. Right. Big old bag, just clear value for your chicken breast. Super cheap. Super easy. Um, step one, open it. Is it open? Is it open? Oh, I, that's right, I did. Look, some of these, once upon a time. Okay, well, that's whatever. <gasps> Man, that's a chicken. So yeah, they're about like, say about like a pound, pound or so worth of chicken breast. And then I was gonna make like a few of them. Those are frozen together. Speaking of food, make sure y'all eat today. Always be sure to eat. Make sure you get your, get your calories in. And, you know, some people say that, you know, oh, because I track my food or whatever and count calories, I have an eating disorder. No, that ain't how that works. An eating disorder is when it gets out of hand. It's like, uh, anorexia, bulim bulimic, am I thinking right? I don't know. There's one where you like purposely make yourself throw up and then there's anorexia where you just like never eat. 
I don't know which is which. But the point is, make sure you eat. Always make sure you're eating. Because if you're not eating, that is actually going to do greater harm. Because I know people who have had eating disorders. And they're just like, yeah, if I stop eating, I'm just going to lose all this weight. Duh. I tried it. It doesn't work. It does not work like that. When you stop eating, what it does is it slows down all your metabolism, which metabolism is what causes your body to burn fat and stuff. So, when you slow down your metabolism, the next time you do eat, which you need to, next time you do eat, it like throws it all out of whack and you don't burn as much calories as you need to. That's why bodybuilders eat like three or four times, no, five or six times throughout the day. They're just trying to keep their metabolism up. That's all they're doing. It's just normal. I look fat right now, bro. I promise it's not me. It's the sauna suit. I'm not, I am not that fat, bro. What the fuck? Why am I shaped like that? I hate that. Oh, well, let's get the hot water going. Another good thing, you know, you don't have to always get like your amino acids from your big company. I prefer First Forms BCAAs. I did just order Ron's EAA, which is essential amino acids. I can't remember what the BC stands for from First Form. But, or you can just get Optimum, Optimum Nutrition. I got the orange flavored amino, amino energy. It's just, this is like EAA, essential amino acids. And I mix it out with my Octa Drink shake, that way it doesn't taste like badonkadonk. I have a feeling this is gonna be easier gonna stop quick. Like, yeah, no, those are wrong. They're wrong. Never mind. They're wrong. But yeah. Ooh, today we had today, so far what I've had today is I've had my Opti Greens with the amino acids. I've taken my CLA and my adrenal restore supplements from first form along with, I take a zinc, zinc's just overall good for you. I take a 50 mil, is it milligram? I think, yeah. Yeah, it would be gram. It's 50 milligram little uh, pill of um, zinc. Zinc's just good for your overall um, immune health. It's just straight up good for you, it's the way it is. Um, so yeah, there's that. Uh, yeah, that's good. Okay. Um, and then I had a five ounces of 80, 20 gram beef. And then I had a banana and now I'm gonna have this chicken breast at some point. I don't know when yet. I'm probably gonna end up cooking this chicken breast whenever I get get home from the gym. That's what we're gonna end up doing. I'm not sure yet. Cause I know like four o'clock, come four o'clock, I'm going for a walk in my weight vest. If I get that outdoor workout for 75 hard in. Because technically that will have been two indoor workouts today and um, one outdoor, which that's more than what it's called for. But it's not about, you know, doing the bare minimum in these types of programs. You don't do the bare minimum, you know. It's like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm only going to do the bare minimum. No, do, do the, go the extra step, man. Never, never do bare minimum. You, you don't want to be a, a bare minimum student. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to. Up there, get up there. Because if you're not up there, guess what? You suck. You don't actually suck. I'm just kidding. Suck is like a really like jumping to conclusion. But yeah, make sure you do. Also, stainless stainless steel blender bottles with a lock on the lid. These things are like bomb. I love this. I invested in it from Academy. It has approximately 22 ounces in it. Which I just like. So you get your cheeks done. I don't even know why I'm putting a blender ball in it. I better just fill this bad boy up with some wawa. But yeah, so we're getting that. That way we get the water in. Because I haven't I haven't been perfect on the drinking the gallon part. I need to get, I need to work on that better. Because I'm like cramming water in my system when like I've been drinking stuff other than water, like my octogreens and like protein shakes. That's because laundry's running. Lost water. I lost like a little bit of water pressure there for a second. 
um, in the fridge. I was like, man, what the, what the heck, man, right? But yeah, so like, yeah, man, you just like, so obviously, you know, put it on, duh. I'm gonna take a sticker off. Cause I'm not stupid. I don't need to be reminded how to use things. How do I open it again? No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, just do it like that. Oh, what? I shouldn't do that. So like chicken. Yeah, it doesn't like just like it doesn't it doesn't just like straight up open. You gotta like hit that little tab and then pop it. And then even if you and when you lock it, you like you can't you can't do it. You can't do it. And I'm not trying to break it in the event that I just like muffle it open. There's that. But yeah, so I need to go take my Microfactor. Microfactor is a supplement. It has CoQ10, a fruit and veggie pill. I can't remember the rest of them. But CoQ10, CoQ10 is good for you. So are the fruits and veggies, of course. Um, Reese is going to get his protein and his supplements. And I, I took JJ his yesterday when I went to the gym. <laughs> so there's that. And so yeah, yeah man, I'm just hanging out. I'm gonna get that done. Four o'clock. I'll check in with y'all because that's when I'm gonna go for my walk my weight best. But uh, yeah. So y'all then. Well, guys, unfortunately, it is not four. In fact, it is five. I went for a mile. Would have been like point eight miles. Um, Forty pound weighted vest walk because I can't run with that on. I trip. Um, went pretty well. Got got a great great sweat going. I had a great sweat from the sauna suit already. We're at the school. I'm about to pick up Lucas and his friend, then take them home. The reason I'm in my dad's truck is because there's fishing poles. Those are not ours. So I have to take him back to his house, which isn't a big deal. I don't mind taking John home. But, yeah, hopefully I see Monsieur de June. Oh, shoot. That's unfortunate. Well. Um, sorry, I messed up the ox. Bad, man. But yeah, so we're just hanging out in the truck right now, waiting for Lucas and John to come out, take him home, take Lucas home. Then I am going to prepare some chicken breast I'm going to grill when I get home from the gym tonight. And I don't want to cook it yet because I'm going to eat it like a reward. It's the way, it's the way I'm going to do it. So... I'm gonna wait till tonight to actually um, cook it. And then that way I'll be all good. And then it's gonna like ensure that I actually, you know, mess up this bench tonight. Oh, I think, I think we're working shoulders with it, chest and shoulders. Ow. Jesus, if y'all are wondering what that was, I had a cramp in that muscle. So, yeah. This thing is so handy. It's, um, oh, wait. Can't, I can't show that on YouTube. Never mind. It's a knife. It's a knife is what it is. It has, like, a box cutter knife. And it's, su it's super nifty, and it's got like a release and everything. That just hit my finger. That could have cut my finger off. That would have sucked. <clears throat> but yeah, so right now, we're just chilling. I don't know why I didn't just set that right there. Duh. Biceps are looking better. Hips are looking better. Feeling wide with the lats. brother and my dad aren't so uh, you gotta like roll it or something or maybe am I blowing in the wrong end 
Yep, no, it's definitely that end. I'm just stupid. Do we have any other dark halls in here that we can try out? Maybe have a whole, uh, whole concert? Nope, guess not. That's unfortunate. Man, that sucks. Yeah, this is, this is not a normal dark call. I don't know what that calls. It calls duck. I just don't know what kind. Let's see what all is in the. Let's see what's in Dad's glove compartment. Not glove compartment. The console. Jesus Christ, Dad. What the heck, bro? It is bamboozling in here, full of junk. I love my dad though. That's, that's okay. I'm not gonna say anything to him about it. That is nothing against homosexuals, by the way, when I said fruity there. He may have just found that on the field. That seems like something my dad would do. Find it and then just pick it up and bring it home. But, I don't know. There's that. Oh my god, Lucas. Where are you? I'm going to beat you up. Alright, well, vlog. Uh, I'll check in whenever I get back to the house. Because basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to fast until I get back home tonight. Which is probably going to be like 10 o'clock at night-ish. I actually might just, now that I'm thinking about this, I might just go ahead and cook it. No, and then when I get home, get home, I will warm it up or something. Do, 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 Well, vlog, I'll check in with y'all when I get back home and I'm preparing chicken, okay? So. What up, gang? We out here at the grill. I'm afraid to set my phone down anywhere because there's grease everywhere. But, so, we out here at the grill. I gotta fire it up and um, clean it first because it rained again. So now, yeah, to open up the propane. Okay. Well, in that case, the moral of that story is, is that number four is not going to last, which I could care less about. Yeah. Now, we clean the grill. That's getting hot. Okay. Mm, never mind. I gotta weigh it. I gotta weigh it. No point in that. Alright, so. Cool. Uh, grill's clean. The seasoning we got on this is. Chili Mexican style. Hot chili pepper. Hot chili seasoning Mexican style or whatever it's called, I think. 
I think that's what it was called. Um, then you have some Old Bay and some garlic and herb and then some Montreal chicken seasoning. So, I think I seasoned it pretty well, you know, because, you know, I'm not, don't season your food white. So, you know, you got to season. You have to. Otherwise, it's just bleh. So, I'm going to put it on here and then uh, I'll check in when I get the finished product. So, fun fact, we're not checking in whenever it's done, but we're checking in right now. It's like something that like one of like my favorite memories that like I have or whatever would definitely be um like some of my old memories of like grilling with my dad when I was like a little kid because if there's one thing that like sitting out there with him for like what felt like forever just watching food cook it definitely taught you um taught well not taught you taught me taught taught me a lot of patience so now like when I when I come out here and I only like, do it myself it's like you just gotta wait because like there's like tons of like good things you can like pick up like when you're cooking and uh patience is definitely one of them it's one of those special ones that um my uh dad taught me so it, it always gets me excited like when i get to cook it's just like yes it it brings back like some sad memories because um we don't do it as much anymore because most of the time when he cooks i'm like coming home from work or something and like i catch it like right whenever he gets done so it's not so much as I'm helping him cook. Whenever he makes hamburgers on the weekends or whatever, most of the time I'll help him or I'll try to. But it just like cooking cooking can teach you a lot of great things. We don't want the chicken to go in the grease trap. That would suck. The thing about blackstones is that like all the heat's in the middle. So yeah. Okay. But now yeah, I just want to share that little tidbit with y'all. Now I'm gonna check it with you. Granny, do you want to say hi? Who is it? It's just vlog. It's vlog. Hi. <laughs> Granny's awesome. Love you, Granny. Love you too, bud. So, we got three chicken breasts. We got some flat out light Italian herb flatbread. 50 calories, 6 carbs, 6 grams of protein. Give us a shot because they said I'm just making chicken tacos with this or a, a wrap of some sort. I need a fork or something. Mm.
Check in with y'all whenever I'm done. Thanks for watching the show. Hey man, you do you. You do you. Okay, vlog. Yeah, we're here. We're about to do Max A again for the, the second attempt at 2:45 tonight. And I have my trusty spotter here today with me, Reese. Reese is back. Yeah. So, what what do you want our next set to be? You want to start with 135? You just want to start with 135? Yeah, 135. Did, did I have a choice? Huh? Did I have a choice? Yeah, I didn't think so. So like, did you grab two points? Okay. Did you put a clip on? Did you put a clip on? No, okay, I didn't think so. All right, so we're gonna rock this out and then we'll take video of when I actually get it. Woo! Hey vlog. Uh, so, uh, Reese, do you want to tell them how it went? Wait, you hit 245 on this. That's one where it went up, it went down, it went up a little bit more, and then it dropped. Alright, cut the video. <laughs> Wipe it. Imagine. But no. Reset 270 for a new max. Barely, but he got there. Well, I mean, I barely got 245. Yeah, it counts, but like. The video scares me though, because it looks like you helped. But I assure you, I felt every single bit of that weight. Yeah. <laughs> My hands touched the bar, so it's like, Reese is very anxious about it, about me lifting. I didn't though. Because I did touch the bar, I came right under it. I came right under it like that. But. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Um, but I, I assure you, I did not lift four. What'd you put it on? Four? four. Right? Yeah, okay. I, I thought I couldn't count for a second. Okay. Uh, just a dumbbell chest press. Uh, let's whip it up. I'm gonna whip it up with 125 first, see how it feels. Because we did max and then everything, yeah, everything's a little tight. So, uh, yeah, just wanna check in with y'all. I made it. I'll be sure to include the film in the vlog, but... Reese has to send it to me first, but you know, that's okay. So, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Ooh, what's up, Bluff? Checking in. Just got working through biceps right now. We're about to switch to triceps. Yeah, we're doing triceps. How are you gonna do bench and not do triceps? I have tiny biceps, okay? I have to do something to make them bigger, okay? I, have un I didn't get the bicep genetic. No, we haven't done triceps. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Chest, bicep, tricep. Monkey mode. <laughs> yeah, Re Reese hates the super set. We just did three, three by ten, three by eight. And Reese, Reese hated that shit. And then we did alternating curls with moderate weight, four by twelve. So Reese hates life right now, is what I mean. Huh? What did you say? I said you hate the shit. Oh, yeah. Basically what I said. Yeah, see? I use this. Whatever it's called. Hypertrophy? Yeah. Hypertrophy. I did the other kind. Powerlifting, bodybuilding combination. I call it Pabalbadev. 
<laughs> body power lifting. I don't know. Power body lifting. Power. Power bow lifting. Body power building. Bow power lifting. Bow power lifting. Bow power. Pobo. 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 Pobo lifting. Pobo lifting. It's a new term. Just basically, you just have the compound movement from for power lifting. You have chest. Wait, Reese. Did you start on that or start on this? Oh, never mind. You're good. Keep doing what you're doing. I thought I was doing extra reps. I'm like, you don't need to do that. Um, basically, you just start the compound movement, like either squat, deadlift, or bench for the power lifting. And then hypertrophy is you do all the accessories, like five steps. Yeah, I've got the vein a little bit there. One day. One day. One day we'll be there. I'm trying to, you can't even see the veins right good in the light. One day we'll be there. Well, I mean, he, he just hit 270, like I said, so. If I can get down to 195 by the end of the year, dog, I'm beat. Oh, you'd be ripped. So I'm going to get through, like, halfway through second quarter, and then I'm bulking. I'm bulking. But, yeah, so we're going to do that, and now we're going to do triceps and switch off. It's going to be fun. I need you to make my thing. Dietary plan? Yeah, I got you. I got you. I haven't had time. Didn't even think about it. I got. I, I know I have to remind you, or else I'll go. <laughs> ADHD's a pain in the I ass. Have, I have it too. Oh, great. I take Pokemon every morning before school. Oh, yeah. I don't take meds. I do. That's how bad mine is. I'll be like in class if I don't take it. Uh, I tap. I tap my foot like the the bouncy leg like, thing. Well, I have my pencil. I'll be like. Oh, I do that too. Like. I'll, I'll get a coin and I'll like flip it through all my fingers. I'm just like like flipping it all the way around. All right, so triceps. Yep, triceps. You're gonna love this workout. Me? Yeah, I, I am. got some triceps. Oh, you got triceps? Oh, Reese's gonna leave triceps. Let's we'll see what happens. Okay, what are we starting with, boy? Oh, we're only doing one workout, but it's like three pull-ups. What are you doing? Just see you later, vlog. Thank you. 
I'll update y'all as soon as we get done with that drop stuff in hell. What up, gang? Just got back to my car. We went to Academy real quick. Hold up. Went to Academy with Reese. Reese lives an hour away. We're streaming with Reese tonight uh, on Apex. So, you see what happens. I had to get sugar free gum. Sugar free gum, dude. It's a lifesaver when you're on the cut. I just put in my, my little glove box. Reese said that this is the Shizak when it comes to monsters, which honestly, it's zero sugar. So, I think that means, okay, it's the same calories. So, the same amount of calories as rain. Uh, fun fact monster makes rain that's crazy to me there's also like this beautiful porsche right there like oh my gosh look at that beauty that thing is nice anyways oh uh, but i rate this monster real quick guys about my gum yeah that gum that gum did not make it to the car when it came to getting open it it didn't make it so Is now open. Bottoms up. Well, there goes Reese. Oh, wait, y'all can see him. Bye bye. Oh, there he goes. Anyways, definitely not my favorite. I, I personally have had better. Reese would be disappointed to hear me say that, but it's I. Right. So uh, we're gonna head home and we're gonna get ready to stream. That is gonna be the conclusion of today's vlog. Hope y'all enjoyed it. As always, love you guys. Hope you guys ate, drank water today, take your supplements if you take supplements, and please like and sub to the channel. Love you guys. Bye.